Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah if you are new here and today we are continuing our 100 baby challenge. It is a sad, sad day. The tree is no longer with us. It's just, I'm sad. I'm just sad, you guys. I talked about how I had post Christmas blues in my last video and uh, yeah, I still got them. Anyways, I'm happy to be filming today. I did not get a chance to build the new 100 baby house yet, but I'm definitely going to. We've been in this house for so long and even though it's very functional, I'm like itching for something new. So yeah, we should have a new house before the next episode or two episodes from now. We'll see how it goes. We have a very full household, so I'm hoping to just clear it out today and have a whole new batch of new babies, but um, I don't know. We're kind of going a little bit slow. A lot of you guys in the comments were saying how fast I'm going through it. It just just really doesn't feel like it, but thank you for saying that. <laughs> I do have a Celsius today, you guys. I finished off my Peach Vibe Celsiuses and I bought myself a 12 pack of Fuji Apple Pear. I haven't had this one in so long. I had a pack of it and I was drinking it all the time and I got sick of it just like the peach ones, but now I don't even remember what it tastes like. I just know that it's good and I'm excited to have this today. So <laughs> cheers to you guys. Cheers to this video. Let's get into it. You know why I like this flavor so much? Y'all ever have Martinelli sparkling apple juice? Oh man, it's so good. And this is what it reminds me of because this is a sparkling one, but it has like a small hint of freshness because of the pear. It's just really good. <laughs> Okie dokie, you guys. Here we are back in the 100 baby household. Happy to be here. Oh, who do we got here? I know this is our son, Forrest. That's right. Tegan needs a tampon. Good for you, Tegan. Let's see what's going on inside. Oh my god, there's so many Sims. It's crazy. And oh my gosh, I totally forgot about Cameron. <gasps> oh man, this Sim, he's a whole vibe. Love him so much. Oh yeah, and I forgot about Jai's turquoise hair. Oh my goodness. I love this batch of kids so much. They're so good and so very cute. All right, let's see. So we've got Cassia who is, it doesn't look like she's pregnant right now, right? Because we have a full house. We've got Isaac and Jai. I feel like we've had them for so long. They're just taking a little bit longer to get moved out. Uh, Tegan and Cameron, and then we've got Archer and then Maya and Lane. Okay. Cool, so what were we waiting on for Isaac and Jai again? Why haven't they moved out? Okay, he's not an A student yet, and he is an A student. Okay, that's what we were waiting for. So he needs to get an A today. So you've already done your homework. You're going to school today. You're gonna get an A by the time you get home. So we'll be able to age them up and move them out as soon as they get back. Fantastic. All right, and what about you two? High school C student? Ay ay ay. okay, and your brother? High school B student. Okay, that's annoying. I wish they were the same so that they can age up at the same time, but it's fine. All right, and then for this bean right here, he's also a C student. His homework is complete. His skills are fine. Fantastic. And what about the little toddler beans? Let's see, level two thinking, level two movement, and potty imagination and communication are all one. So I'm gonna get her to work on her communication scale. Okay, and what about this bean? Three, two, two, one. Not bad, not bad at all. Let's do imagination for you, love. I hope you guys had a fantastic holiday break. I know a lot of you went back to school already and that's like a big bummer and I'm sorry, <laughs> but I hope that your break was good. I have a few more weeks left until I have to go back to school and you guys, I'm really not looking forward to it. Cassia, are you insulting your children again? <laughs> She's almost maxed her charisma skill. Let's get her to work on that. Or wait, I, w I read that if a um, an adult, if an adult does skills with the with her kids, then their skill goes up faster. I think that's pretty tight. So we should probably take advantage of that as much as we can. All right, everybody, have a fantastic day at school. Listen to your teacher. You know the drill. Oh shoot! I always accidentally click hit instead of babble. <laughs> Please don't hit the bear. Please. All right, keep going. You are almost there. Work them skills, guys. Work them. Okay, cool. There she goes. Level three. Now let's go ahead. Uh, what should we do? Thinking, I guess. Thinking and movement. So she watches Cassia, walks across the house. That works on her movement. And then she comes over here, 
watches her brother. She has to walk clear across the house again. So it's like killing two birds with one stone, you know? And there you go! You did it! Imagination level three. I am so proud of you. I'm gonna get them both to bob to music now because they both need movement! But, 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 from being silly, you know what? Chicken butt. That never gets old. Oh my goodness. Alrighty then. Yes, yes, yes. Keep on practicing that speech. And who's the next baby daddy for us, guys? I already forgot, so that's fun. Oh, you know what? I don't even think we chose yet. Do you guys think that it's more beneficial to work on oh my gosh you're so pregnant with no pants on to uh get all of the kids out before we start getting pregnant again or get pregnant like as children move out so like let's say we move these two out and then cassie gets pregnant um or should we wait until everyone is out of the house and then just keep having babies like back to back i don't know We've been doing it the first option lately, and I'm kind of tempted to like clear out the house and start fresh and see how that goes for us. Yup, keep on bobbing. You're not to level three yet. You gotta get to level three. Ew! Lane, that was a nasty fart. She's almost level eight charisma. Go Cassie, yeah! <laughs> Parenting, mischief, logic, cooking, and charisma is gonna be her skills. Welcome back, everybody! Lawrence is asking us out on a date. Nah. Oh, yes! Grades are freaking up for everyone, it looks like. All right, hold up. A student. A student. B student, that's fine. A student, there we go. B. Okay. All right. Do we have a cake in the fridge? I'm thinking probably not, but I'm gonna check anyway. <laughs> cake? <gasps> we do! It's a hamburger cake too! I wonder if we can blow out can- Oh my gosh, we can in the middle of this table. That's so cute. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Yes, yes, yes. Welcome home, everybody. Everyone do your homework, please. And oh, it looks like everyone has a project as well. Would like to come over and hang out? Yes, 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 come, come, come. Tina Tinker keeps showing up in all my Let's Plays. I'd rather her not. <laughs> I don't know why. Okay, who was born first? I think it was Isaac. So let's go ahead, get him to make a wish. And then we'll see what kind of sim he's gonna be. Goodbye, ma'am. Thank you for cleaning. Appreciate you. Cheer up, you know? Happy birthday to ya. Oh my gosh, I forgot how many layers this kid has. So he wants to go to college. He's a player, a klepto, and his last trait? <laughs> Chopstick savvy. Hmm. Okay. I mean, sure. I guess. Okay, uh, please add more candles and let's go ahead and decide your life. See what your job's gonna be, all that good stuff. Decide Isaac's life. All right. So, holy cannoli, 99437, I think that's what that says. 99437. I'm sorry if it was like a dollar off. It's fine. So he got bank savings outstanding. Bonus trait, good cook. Career choice, diver. That's not what I had in mind, but okay. Friends, friend amount, small amount. A skill learning average. Miss hanging out from not socializing with friends. Uh, same Isaac. Big same. I also have that moodlet, so that's fun. Okay, time for your brother. I'm actually really, really excited to see what career he gets. So come on over, make a wish. He has the purveyor of potions aspiration. He's lazy and he's a recycled disciple. <laughs> All right. Oh, but he's teaching her to talk. That's so sweet. These brothers, they're so good with the kids. I love it. It warms my heart. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Yeah, sing it. Thanks for letting me, um, not letting me uh, sing alone. Okay, his last trait is going to be business savvy. Random, but okay, whatever, that's fine. You know what else we should do? We should enroll <coughs> Isaac in uni. I think that makes sense. But shoot, it always takes so freaking long. I wish there was a cheat. 
I wish there was a cheat. We could just like enroll them in MC Command Center. Is there? I've actually never checked. Hold on. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, here we go. Enroll in university. Yes. Yes! Oh my gosh, that makes it so much easier. All right, I think we're going to do for him... Hmm, let's do Foxbury. And for his, uh, let's see, his degree, oh my gosh. His traits don't really... <laughs> don't really say that he has interests. So I guess we could just do something like... Let's do economics. I don't think I've ever chosen that before in my life, so... There you go. Let's do at home. That way we can still move him out and give him the money that he earned okay, with household funds. Okay, perfect. All right, sir. Let's see what you got. Decide his life. Ooh, engineer. Huh? Interesting. Another An outstanding bank savings. Crap. I didn't see how much money he made. I know we had like 159. 159 something before we decided his life. I need to learn to pay more attention. <laughs> I might have to um, fix it in the next episode after I rewatch this because yeah, I can't remember. But anyway, bank savings outstanding. Feeling, pr uh, let's see, what else we got? Career choice engineer. Bonus trait weak. Uh, small amount of friends. And skill learning average. Alrighty then. Okay, well, happy birthday to them. I'm gonna go ahead and move them out now. Yeah, go ahead and jumpstart on that. I wanna say that we had like 70 something thousand dollars in our account. Okay, so I know for a fact 99437 was Isaac's. And then, uh, shoot. I think that's what it was. When I rewatch this though and edit it, if I'm completely wrong, then I'll fix our money when we get back when we get back into the house in the next episode. <laughs> Sorry guys, I need to learn how to pay more attention about how much money they get when they move out. Okay, I'm gonna move them into this house in um in Brightchester. Why not? Oh my gosh, look at the state of our house. Holy cannoli, what is going on? All right, come clean. Oh my gosh, all of our toilets are broken too. Oh, look at this cute display. I love it when they all do their homework together. It's so cute. And these two beans did not get to their level three movement when I told them to keep bobbing. Keep on bobbing, loves. Okay, so I'm gonna, oh shoot. <laughs> I'm gonna get her to finish her homework and then come out here and start working carefully on her project. And you, sir, you're an A student, so all you really have to do is do your homework and keep it keep it at an A. Attention seeker from falling down. Cameron totally did that on purpose. Wow, Cameron. Wow. And then we need one skill to level four for Archer. It, um, it looks like his social's almost there, so I think we're fine. Let's go ahead and goof around with Cameron, just get that up. All right, there you go. You did it. Perfect. So... <laughs> Shoot, by the time everyone comes home tomorrow, we should all have- they should all have A's, I mean. Actually, the only person- yeah, it's just- it's just Archer and Tegan that I'm worried about. Did you reach level 3 yet? You did, you could stop now. She's feeling hungry, so I'm gonna get- he's already back, you guys. Isaac is already back. <laughs> Let's eat some ceviche! We gotta eat the ceviche! Let's uh, put this out, grab some. All right, Tegan finished her project. That's what's up. That is definitely what's up. Let's put the cake in here, have some ceviche. You know what? I don't think I'm gonna wait because the longer that I wait without her being pregnant, the, lo the faster she's gonna age. So I'm thinking next up should be... <sighs> I don't think we've had babies with him yet. All right, yeah, let's do that. What time is it? 7 a.m.? Uh, I think I'm just gonna cheat him over. I ain't got time to wait an hour. Hey, sir! Welcome, 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 welcome. Uh, let's just do an impression. Let's, um, hmm. Compliment his appearance as well. Nice pants, dude. Really like your pants. Really like that facial expression you're making. I mean, just great. 
So so. Oh, they're actually sitting down to chat. I love that. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. <laughs> Um, ask about his day, just get to know him a bit, you know, tell him a funny story. Ooh, charisma level 9, that's what's up. He did it. Oh, I think he likes us. He's laughing. Let's beguile him, of course. Oh, he's good! Love that for you, Cassia. Da ding! Cupid is here! Time to turn on the heat. Don't you dare leave! Hey! You don't get to leave, sir. No. He's really leaving. He's seriously leaving us. Wow. We can rake leaves? Why have I never seen that in The Sims before? I know it's probably the last thing you want to do right now, Cassia, but like, I need to see this. I need to see this for myself. <gasps> what? That's how those piles get formed? I had no idea. I'm gonna need this guy to come back. I don't know why he left in the first place. He was here for like five minutes. Oh wow, yeah, and it cleans up all the leaves. Or oh, he's sleeping. It's 9.30, sir. I'm not saying that I wouldn't be sleeping at 9.30, but like that's bizarre for Sims, is it not? All right, let's get the mail as well. It's a chore day, apparently. All right, what do we get? A Shinolite, okay, selling that. University acceptance letter, trash, and seeds. Sick. Okay, this bean really needs food. There's ceviche over here, come and get it. I know you probably don't like it, but like, that's the food we got. Hey, how about instead of collecting the dishes on this table, why don't you clean them up? Just a thought. Oh, she's squeamish. She doesn't like the spoiled food. <laughs> Honestly, I'm the same way. I don't know about you guys, but whenever I do dishes, and there's like soggy food in the sink and I have to touch it. Mm-mm, that's game over. That is game over. Just something about soggy food. It just freaking gets to me. <laughs> ah, what are you confident from? Feeling much better from recovery. Cameron is recovering from his insecurity. It's time for him to learn to love what he has. Aw, ain't that sweet. Oh crap, it's the freaking weekend. Dang it. Now we have to wait two days to age these beans up. All right, well, I guess I just won't focus on them. I will focus on the little toddlers. This one desperately needs a bath, so let's ask Tegan for one. Uh, what do you need? You also need a bath, so let's ask Cameron for one. Brother and sister, please give us baths. Please, please give us baths. Oh, isn't that sweet? One set of twins is giving the other set of twins baths. That is so cute. Thank you guys for helping. I appreciate you. That synchronized bath time though. I love it. Eliza, I'm looking for a mind at work. <sighs> another day, another Hamilton song stuck in my head. Wow, Cassia, the yard be looking real nice. Real, real nice. Oh, are you stuck now? Okay, come over here. Let's get you, I'm gonna get you to dream big actually, see what's up. That's something we don't see often, Cassia in her workout outfit. Ooh, I actually really like this. Oh, almost, almost. All right, what skill for you? Putty, yeah, let's do putty, ask for putty help. Cameron, yes, I had a bath, but now we need to go potty. Will you help me? Let's do the same <laughs> with uh, Tegan and Maya as well. <laughs> Synchronized bath time and now synchronized potty time, okay? Thank you guys for not giving me any issues and doing what I tell you. It really does mean the world to me. Oh, I told you to dream big and now you're going to get cookies. That's the mood. Oh, you sprained your ankle. Oh my god, there's LaCroix in this fridge. LaCroix. Sorry if I'm saying that wrong. I still don't have no idea how to say it, even though I've had it a million times. <laughs> there you go, level two. You can now use the pussy all by yourself. You as well, Maya. Yay, you guys are doing great. I love this synchronized learning session. But our bean does need food now. Are you gonna give her some? Oh, you don't have to potty train her anymore. Bring her over here and give her some... 
give her ham and cheese sandwich. Come on, Maya. Come on, let's eat. I hate it when the kids leave their dirty dishes on this. Come clean this up. You need to have better, is it manners or responsibility? Um, Manners, you need to have better manners. Come clean these potties as well. Everyone needs to do their part around here, you know? If she's going to have a sandwich in this little chair, come and... I wish we could just like turn on the TV. Let's watch Kids Network with her. Watch sports. No, 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 no. Watch Kids Network. How cute are they? Little sisters enjoying some lunch, watching the Kids Network on the Penguin TV. Love that for us. But can you please stop making a mess and eat you sh eat your food? Don't play with it. What are you doing? Are you telling her a story? Aww. I love them. Love them, love them, love them. Little sisters. Yes, who's calling Cassia? Wanna go on a date? No. Speaking of dates, we need to invite that dude over. Advik! Time to come over. Time to plant a seed. You're having another serving of cook- Cassia! If you're hungry- He's sleeping still! What is wrong with this guy? Maybe he works graveyard shifts? Either way, I'm going to uh, summon him because ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> oh, welcome, sir. First kiss, yes, let's go. Let's freaking go. We all don't want to miss it. Dun, 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 dun. He's like, wow, what a greeting. What a greeting. Let's just do a little sexy pose. Let's do some seducing. This seems like a good guy. He's got the caregiver archetype. He has a good trait. I feel bad for taking advantage of him just for his seed. Who is this person? We don't even know you! Or do we? No, you don't get to leave. Why are you thinking about that graveyard? Or that grave? Don't leave! No! Stay. Stay right there. We need to try for baby. Honey, 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 honey! Oh my god, we can! Yes, let's go, let's freaking go. We haven't had a baby with him yet, right? Oh no, now I'm second guessing myself. Hold up. What is this little love doing? Bob into music. No, 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 no. I'm gonna need you to play dollies. Play dollies. Um, You're sleeping, that's fine. Okay. All right, Cassia. All done? Not quite. Take a pregnancy test, please. Yes, girl! That's what I'm talking about. Here we freaking go. Did he leave yet? Did he leave? Oh, shoot. Max here. He said, who are you? Oh, I just woohooed with your daughter in the shower. What's up? <laughs> I would not say that. Like, okay. <laughs> if you were to go on a date with Cassia or pursue Cassia in any way and then you met her father... Would you be scared? I would 100% be scared. I'd be like, I'm good, dude. I am good. I'll see you later, though. <laughs> I'd be s Oh, socks. Interesting choice. Okay. I need to ask him if he has kids because I honestly don't remember. Ask about children. Don't flirt with each other in front of father here. But he looks proud. <gasps> no, no, no! 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 He's flirting with- 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 What?! They just flirted with each other! What the- That is- the, this is such a weird triangle, I really don't like it. I am a parent. Right. Okay, but who are your kids, though? That's the real question. <gasps> He's a vampire! I had no idea, but oh my gosh, that's so exciting. And it makes total sense now why he was sleeping during the day. I thought he worked graveyard shifts, but no, he's a vampire. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, we definitely haven't had kids with him yet then. 
Anyways, how are you, Father? Let's just share the big news. Let's invite him in. Is there anything in the fridge that we can buy? Ooh, flirty heart cookies. Let's make those. I'm just coming in, Dad. I'm just about to make some cookies. The kids are... I don't know what they're doing. They're somewhere around here. Did you get to level three imagination? Fantastic, my love. Okay, potty's the next thing. So just come over here and potty. What's he doing with you, though? Was he teaching you to talk? That's so cute. Okay, keep going, potty. Uh, this bean is slacking behind his sister. You need to get up. Get some food. And we'll work on your skills as well. I can't believe they flirted. Is free love on? Oh, that's probably why. Lily, Lily, Max here. Oh my gosh, what are they gonna do? What are you guys gonna do? What do you, what is this dance? What is this dance? Are you playing musical chairs? Musical headstones, I mean. What is happening right now? Why, 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 why? <laughs> They're waltzing or doing whatever dance this is. What the heck? Oh my goodness. This is hilarious. Please. I want you to stop though. I really want you guys to like do something because they woohooed to make Cassia. Both of her parents are here. Oh my gosh, my heart. I have no idea how long they're going to do this for, but I'm just going to leave them to it. I'm going to go ahead work on his uh, thinking skill. Are they still doing it? Oh, no, they're not. What are they doing? Just vibing in here? What? Why are you guys gasping at her? She oh, because she's going potty. <laughs> it's fine. It's just a little toddler. And look at this, you guys. Watch Maya, but there's a little potty next to it. I wonder if you'll get thinking skill and potty skill by watching her. That'd be pretty fantastic. Yes, he does. Or just potty skill, but either way, that's pretty dope. Cassie would rather watch TV on the Penguin TV than on the flat screen. I think she's a kid at heart who really desperately needs some sleep. Cameron, why don't you introduce yourself to your grandmother, the iconic Lily Potter? Oh shoot, the thing broke. Uh oh, did you guys' father die? Fathers don't have phones. Okay, then why is hers ringing? You're almost there, honey. Just level up, and then you can go straight to bed. Lately, when I've been playing Sims, my hand goes numb. So that's fun. I think I spend way too much time on the computer. Which, like, really sucks because being on the computer is my whole life right now. For school, for YouTube, for Twitch, for games. Like... I can't not be on the computer, so I'm gonna have to, like, figure out a way to solve this issue. Honey, 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 if you gotta pee, go pee, you know? Nothing's stopping you. You can have this cereal, too. Oh my gosh, okay, I'm getting Cassie to dream big, but it looks so much different than normal, and I think it's because she's pregnant. She just stands in one spot and shoots. She doesn't, like, try and dunk or anything. Very interesting. What house is this over here? This is really, really cute. Both of these. I must have placed them a long time ago and forgot. <laughs> interesting. I'm just kind of killing time until Monday because I uh, can't do anything until then. I kind of want her to come over here and- Oh, she can't skate because she's pregnant? Dude, that is so stupid. That is so, so, so stupid. Alright, let's get her to come. Come skate around. She kind of has a high fitness skill. Dude, yes, this outfit. She kind of has a high fitness skill, so I'm curious to see how good she is on the rink. Oh man, you guys, that would be so much fun to do with Zoe in my legacy challenge because she maxed her fitness skill. <gasps> yes, that would be so cool. That's like something in the seasons pack that I haven't really, look at that game, look at that face, she's so focused. But it's something in the, it's the seasons pack that I haven't fully explored. Oh, nice dude. 
Customize rink. Yes! Confetti! Oh my... Why don't, why don't I do this more? It's so cute. Turn on party lights. Dude, we need to do this more. We need to do this more for like birthday parties and things like that. Oh look, Kareem's over here watching. His skin tone needs to be fixed, but still cute either way. Oh my gosh, let's get some spiked sparkling apple juice right now after a little bit of ice skating. What a mood day. Hey Forrest, you're everywhere, aren't you? One sparkling cider, please. Ooh, pretzels. What's wrong with you? Why are you so pissed off? This is a nice day you're having. Enjoy it. What? Where are you going? Oh, you're gonna go sit? <gasps> so cute! Oh my gosh. Mood! You guys, I miss going outside. <laughs> I miss doing things. What a good day. I wonder if she has some bomb moodlets. Cup of cozy. Pretty tasty, and curiosity satisfied from asking about sexuality. Oh, you're gonna do your homework now? I swear I already told you to do it. Oh, you're doing extra credit. All right, I'll leave you to it. What are you up to, sir? You have a lot of moodlets. Dang. Oh yes, clean that up, what a good boy. And then you need some sleep, so head to bed. Why are you so sad? Bullied? No, you're such a cute bean. Ooh, ooh, someone did winter crafts. <gasps> Let's put them right there. We'll move this one here. Look at that. Look at how many crafts we have on the wall. I could cry so cute. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. I'm actually going to get him to make some more crafts. Let's cast you singing to him because he's sad. Let's make... Let's do... Winterfest spirit. Yeah, boy! Make them crafts! Get it, my dude. Hope this makes you feel better. Okay, he's done. This is interesting. Let's see what it looks like on the wall. Oh, okay. It's just another one of these banner things. There we go. Cute! But he's still feeling sad. <sighs> All right, wind down with classical, I guess. <laughs> Yay, he's happy now. From making crafts, cozy fireplace, and the... Okay, now he's sad again. <sighs> that didn't last. Let's put out the roast chicken and the... Ooh, vegetable tempura. Ugh, every time I see that in this game, I just, like, immediately crave it. Cassie, have yourself some roast chicken. How's that pregnancy coming along? Third trimester in 24 hours. All right. Dude, holy cannoli. Look at how many um, aspiration points Cassie has. Let's spend some. What are we doing? We could get her the fertile trait, but the lot trait, I feel like, helps us a lot. <laughs> so I don't know. Uh, we could get her the seldom sleepy. We could get the money tree. I wonder if that's against the rules. We can get her another retrading potion. So should we get her two three thousand dollar ones or one four thousand or five thousand dollar one? I'm kind of thinking we get her the seldom sleepy. And anything for two thousand? Two thousand. Steel bladder perhaps or shameless. We'll never get embarrassed. <sighs> yeah, let's go ahead and do that. All right, cool. Very, very cool. You know what I think would be really easy? The friend of the world aspiration. Because we almost have level 10 charisma. Have 20 friends. Oof, that seems like a tall order. Let's see. Let's try it. I think, um... Hmm. What? What are you doing? Where are you? You left again? You were gonna go ice skating again? Wow, I think she found something that she likes. That's pretty cute. Oh crap, the toddler's up. Never mind. I said we were gonna go out and do something, but never mind. <laughs> the children need need uh, food. Need um Oh my god, I'm totally blanking on the Spanish word for food. Comida. Comida. There you go. Level three potty skill. Very good boy. So what do you have left? Uh thinking. Okay. 
All right, Maya has completed all of her skills. Thank goodness, because she desperately needs some fun. I'm gonna get her to watch the TV for a bit. Cassia is teaching Lane basic needs to get his thinking up. It's almost there. Almost, my boy. Almost. And then the uh, teens have school in an hour. Fantastic. People like you, look around. Look around, look around. <laughs> Go have some chicken for breakfast. Your mood is fantastic. How about you? Yours is pretty good too, but why don't you get up, wash your hands, brush your teeth, and you will be all set. There you go, level three. So we can now age up these beans. I can't believe we haven't done a, what the heck happened to the cake? No, what? Uh, oh my God, how annoying. All right chocolate cake. You know what would be fun if we could age up Sims with cupcakes as well? Listen to the teacher. Listen to the teacher. Listen to the teacher. Doom, 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 doom. Okay, so that's all taken care of. This baby. Right, we just need the cake. And Cassia is, for some reason, not doing what I'm telling her. Shocker. Happy, happy birthday from Applebee's to you. We wish it was our birthday so we could party too. Happy birthday, Maya. We love you. You gonna age up or what? All right, guys. So Maya is going to be a social butterfly and her trait, spice hound, a child who likes spicy food. Okay, I mean, I guess. <laughs> that just seems so very random for a kid, but okay, you do you. Oh, Cassia has the people person lifestyle. Nice, dude. Lane, let me get a good look at you. Look over here, baby. I need to see your eyes. Okay, gray eyes, black hair. All right, cool. Finally, Cassia, dang. Took you long enough. Oh my God, and now you're just not doing it? I could scream. Let's see what his aspiration is gonna be. Artistic prodigy. All right. Happy birthday, Lane. Happy, happy birthday. <laughs> Cute. Come on, sir. All right. Artistic prodigy and his trait is music lover. Nice. So he's going to be very musical, musical, musical bean. Musical, musical, musical bean, musical, 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 and so many gifts coming in the mail. Oh my word. We're gonna have to age up uh, Archer when he gets home, so I think we should hold off on the makeovers. Nope, don't you dare touch that clay. Come over here and put more candles on. And then what do you guys need to do? Just do your homework. All right. Okay, it looks like Archer a uh, got an A and Tegan also got an A. Fantastic. Where'd the cake go? Why does the cake always disappear? Ah, <sighs> all right. First things first, let's age up Archer. Make a wish, sir. Make a little wish, sir. Wish from the bottom of your heart, sir. What's this? Very nice. Well, happy birthday. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh yeah, he had the pink eyes. He has Cassia's eyes, black hair, like freckles. Oh my gosh, mood. Mood, mood, mood. All right, his aspiration is going to be world famous celebrity. I love that one. I don't know why. Okay, so he's a collector and his other trait is vegetarian. Cute, I love him. Add more candles. Let's age up Cameron. Yeah, Cameron and Tegan, nice. <laughs> Blow out the candles, babe. Let's age you up, babe. Yes, confetti. Love to see it. All right, her last trait, marketable. Marketable Sims sell items they've crafted for more simoleons. Oh, she wants to be a celebrity too. She's socially gifted, squeamish, and marketable. Okay, maybe she'll be famous for stuff that she makes. Maybe she's famous on Etsy or something. <laughs> I don't know. But let's go ahead and decide her life and uh, let me pay attention to how much money. Decide Tegan's life. 5,077. Okay, and she got bank savings good. 
Uh, bonus trait, weak. <laughs> Career choice, fisherman. <sighs> Why? That's... that... no. That doesn't make any sense. Skill learning, good. Um... I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Uh, Cameron, you're next. What are you over doing? Free throws? Dude, nice. I kind of want to change uh, Tegan's job from fisherman to freelancer. I think that makes more sense. What, Cassia? It's your son's birthday. You need to act more happy. All right. So Cameron is the curator. He's clumsy. He is a piper and his last trait is perfectionist. Nice, I love how all of the traits match. Like the colors, it's just, it's very aesthetically pleasing and it's organized and I just love it. Whoa. <laughs> okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. let's decide your life, Mr. Sir. Yes, please quit. 1,097. All right, these two don't have a lot of money, but that's fine. Um, oh, he wants to be a lawyer? Holy cannoli, okay, wow. Bank savings, bad. Bonus trait, drinker. An alcoholic law lawyer, nice, love it. <laughs> Skill learning, good. Social life, average, okay, cool. All right, so we can move these two out. Archer makeover, Maya makeover, and Lane makeover. Okay, I think I'm gonna do the makeovers first and then we'll move these beans out. So let's hop into create a sim and put our makeover hats on. Okay, I see a lot of Cassia in him. He has the Cassia mouth, which is a good mouth, so love to see it. It looks like he aged up with the correct freckles and moles as well. You guys, look at how beautiful he is. Fangs, though? No, no, no. No fangs, sir. Wow, he is so cute. And I really want to give him either plugs or... Or some other kind of piercing. Oh, shoot, we're in cold weather. It's absolutely crazy that you have to have an expansion pack to have a piercing in The Sims 4. HENCHOO! <laughs> what kind of crap is that? Okay, yeah. Big fan of those. Looking good. Let's go ahead and find you a hair now. I don't think I've downloaded any new male hairs in a while besides these ones. Ooh! I don't normally like this hair, but it looks super good on him. Shoot, what color was his hair? Oh, it was black. Okay. Okay, wait. Ugh, I haven't used this hair in so long and I absolutely love it, but I definitely want to change the beanie color. I actually like it in black. He's so cute! <gasps> I'm excited. All right, let's find him something to wear now. Who's his father again? Jules! Jules is his father. Well, that makes a whole lot of sense why he's very cute. This is my favorite crew neck to put on, guys. It's by KK Sims. I don't know what it is. It's just like the shape of it is just chef's freaking kiss. It's so good. Like, I wish I had this in real life. <laughs> so cute. I really need some new male stuff, you guys. Oh, I am desperate. If you know of any CC creators that make some, like, fire male CC that's not Darte77 or Gorilla Gorilla Gorilla, <laughs> Anyone else, let me know because, yeah, I need some new stuff. I'm tired of using the same same clothes literally all the time. All right, you guys, Archer's all done. Let's move on to Mr. Lane here. It looks like he ages up with the same eyes and the same hair, which is crazy because that never happens, but nice. Been loving these brows lately. I'm sorry that I'm using them so much. They're just real good brows. He's so cute! I love his little mouth. It's actually adorable. Look at him! He's so cute! I love this outfit. <laughs> cutie, cutie, cutie. Okay, let's move on to your sister. Maya! Were those the eyes that you had? <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, we can give her this one. I think her hair was similar to this when she was a bean. Right? It was like dark brown and curly or wavy like this. Oh, she's so adorable. Oh my gosh, yes. So cute, okay. 
I wish I could remember which eyes she had. I think it was those. I'm almost positive. And I don't mind these brows either. Oh, look at this button-up sweater cardigan thing. <gasps> that is so cute. I like this color palette. All right, you guys. So we have Archer, we've got Lane, and we've got Maya. They're all so cute. I hope that you like them. All right, sir, you do your homework and then we'll work on your skills. Probably just have you dream big because it's the fastest. Third trimester in four hours. Okay. Probably won't do have her give birth in this episode. Oh no, stop, stop, stop yelling at her. Stop. Oh God, I hate that so much. Smooth apology. Smooth apology. Um invite to feel the baby just say like i'm pregnant i have these m hormones and mood swings i'm sorry do you want to you want to feel feel the belly please feel the belly all right y'all are good now right <laughs> okay let's put the cake away and then so we're gonna move out tegan and cameron okay Let's get him out of here, guys. Let's go. <laughs> wow. I can't believe it. We're gonna have four spots open. Crazy. Alrighty. Goodbye, Tegan. Goodbye, Cameron. You two are some of my favorites for sure. So cute. Where should we move them in at? Maybe Del Sol Valley because she wants to be famous. I can see them living there. <laughs> oh my gosh, Mac lives in Del Sol Valley. Let's move in next door to him. Okay, so very exciting that Cassia is pregnant with hopefully vampire babies. Hopefully we have twins or triplets. Yeah, they'll be worth two. Oh my gosh. Mm, I'm excited. Third trimester in three hours. Maybe we should stick around until she has them. I'm like dying to know what they are. So I have been watching Cobra Kai on Netflix with my family. We watched Karate Kid recently just to like <laughs> refresh ourselves on what happened because I haven't seen it in a really long time. She made crafts. Let me put those up. But yeah, <laughs> I'm so obsessed with it. I think about it all the time. You know when you're just like just so immersed in a show that it kind of takes over your life for a little bit and then when it ends you're just like what do I do with my life now? <laughs> and you like think about the characters as if you know them in real life. Is it just me? If it's just me, I'm probably crazy. Let me know. Oh my gosh, she grabbed cereal and I was like, what the, why is it in a black bowl? But then I realized it's Outpost popcorn mix from Journey to Batu. <laughs> I was so confused for a second. I'm gonna actually head into Cass and fix her skin tone real quick too. So Gretchen Rico was, I want to say, I want to say she was about there. Oh, let's give her her last trait too. She's gloomy, ambitious, and let's give her the unflirty trait. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh my, <gasps> hold the Phone. She's married to Jules. Oh my god. The spice level is like ghost pepper hot right now. She is. Oh my gosh. She's Archer's stepmom. I wonder if she knows. Wow. That is so freaking spicy. Holy crap. I wonder if she knows. Having to go to your husband's mistress's house every day and clean up after her mess and all of her kids mess. I can't. I'm going to pretend like she doesn't know because that makes it like so much more fun. I don't know why. Looks like Tali is here. Let's have a deep personal conversation with her. Love your coat. You look so chic. Where are you guys going? Why are you going in the middle of the street to talk? Oh no, who died? Yeah, who died? Mason! <gasps> you guys, that was Cassia's first kid. Oh my gosh. How are you feeling about that? It's your fifth moodlet. 
Okay, seems like you don't care that much. Her first kid, oh no, that means all of her other kids are gonna start dying now. Okay, I'm high key sad and worried. I wonder if Mason ever had any children. Let's find out. He didn't, I wonder why. All right, all of the kids have done their homework and got their skills to their uh, levels. So I'm gonna go ahead and travel with Cassia somewhere just to kill time because I really just want her to be in labor. <laughs> But I also want to complete her aspiration. So, hmm, where should we go? Let's go to the Salty Paws Saloon, see what's good over there. She needs to introduce herself to 10 Sims, so I'm hoping we can get that done. Maybe we should have got her the incredibly friendly aspiration perk thing, because when you have that, you can hit people with the... I think it's the nice introduction or something like that. Oh my gosh, it's snowing here. And the relationship bar just like shoots up. Looks like Kareem's ah. here. Let's just brighten his day. Oh, she's in labor. Okay, that was fast. Well, let's just introduce ourselves to these people while we're here. And then we can go have the baby. All right, darling, you are in labor, giving a flirty introduction to everyone that you see. Oh my gosh, okay. I guess we can join her at the hospital today. Let me bust out my list of names here. Uh, I haven't updated it in a while. I need to go through the comments and do that but there are plenty of names here that I haven't used yet. So these are, it's a girl, that's what's up. Oh, that's a cute one. This must be old cause it's kind of further down the list, but Mishka, I really like that name. Let's do that. Mishka for the girl and then for the boy we'll do, let's do, is Remy a boy's name or a girl's name? I would say that's probably pretty androgynous. All right, Mishka and Remy, twins. Fantastic. Oh my gosh, they're vampires. I saw it, I saw it. I'm thinking that they both are, but I'm not 100% sure. I wish there was a way that we could check. I'm gonna just assume and put two points for each of these babies because you get two points for every occult. And if one of them ends up not being a call, I'll go ahead and subtract a point. But I know for sure that one of them is. All right, guys. Well, I'm going to go ahead and leave this part right here. We did pretty good in this episode. I'm very satisfied. We finally got some occult babies, which is what I have been striving for for the past like three episodes. And it was totally on accident too. But I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. My next video is going to be Not So Berry, which I'm very excited about because that series is absolutely chaotic and wild right now and I love it. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching. I love you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!